work and energy work when you study or do your homework you usually say that you are working but in the language of science we explain the word work in a different way when force is applied on an object and it moves through a distance then we say that work is done when we go and open a door we do work when we lift some load and move it to another place then we do work when we move the table we do work we apply force to do work if the applied force does not move the object to a distance it is said that work is not done we often work with our hands sometimes we require the help of simple tools for example we need a screw driver to join two things with a screw we use tools called simple machines to make our work easier or to increase the speed of work for example a pair of scissors cuts paper faster and in a better way than tearing paper energy sometimes when you feel tired you say that i don't have any more energy left what is this energy and why do we need it energy is the ability to do work we need energy to talk study run play eat breathe and to do other activities all creatures need energy to do their work a machine also needs energy to operate everything that moves or functions needs energy sources of energy we get our energy from food cars buses aeroplanes and trains get energy from fuels like petrol and diesel electricity wind and flowing water are also different sources of energy wind energy is used to run a windmill the energy of flowing water is used to run a water wheel the energy sources can be divided into two categories one renewable sources of energy two non renewable sources of energy renewable sources of energy the sources of energy such as sun wind water etc which provide us energy continuously without getting exhausted are called renewable sources of energy non renewable sources of energy non renewable sources of energy are those which once used up cannot be replenished within a reasonable period of time for example fossil fuels petroleum coal natural gas etc different forms of energy energy is available in different forms some important forms of energy are light energy light is a form of energy which produces the sensation of vision it enables us to see objects around us light energy from the sun is an important source to sustain life on the earth because plants prepare their food in the presence of the sunlight during the process of photosynthesis solar cells can convert the light energy from the sun into electrical energy heat energy this is a very essential form of energy which is used for cooking food and drying clothes it is also used in factories for various purposes thermal power stations use it to produce electrical energy fuels such as petrol gas and wood are important sources of heat energy the sun also gives us heat energy food that we eat burns inside our body and keeps us warm electrical energy nowadays this form of energy is commonly used this energy is used in our houses for running various machines and electrical appliances 
it can be produced from various sources from sunlight from water falling from a height or from burning coal sound energy sound energy is produced by vibrations of an object all vibrations may not produce sound when a whistle is blown it produces vibration and we are able to hear the sound when sound waves strike the ear membrane it begins to vibrate and produces a sensation of hearing if you strike a drum its membrane vibrates and produces a sound energy can be changed from one form to another it can neither be destroyed nor produced the sun is the ultimate source of energy for the earth we must use solar energy along with water and wind energy as much as possible these sources of energy will be available to us for a long time coal and petrol are not so easily available to everyone they are also available in limited quantity as well we should conserve other sources of energy for our future generations know this work is the conversion of one form of energy into another form